Hello folks, Luke Simons with you, back to the Basics 101. Today, we're gonna take a look, a gander, at something me and my son made probably back in October. And uh, the cattle are loving it, the bulls are loving it, so I wanna share that with you. And I'm gonna show you a bunch of pictures of other products that I seen, not products, but inventions on ranches. Going there, and then we're gonna check the goldfish today. I stuck some goldfish in, I believe, in October of 2017. And I checked them periodically, but we've had 40 below and 50 below. And this is a spring that continuously flows 23 gallons a minute. Let's take a look, a gander, shall we? Here we are. This is what it is, folks. Oh, knee up, snow up to my knees here. That there, my cattle love it. And you're thinking to yourself, what is it? Well, let me show you. See that or not, those little plastic tines are about a foot. And they are beautiful. Just stuck an old wood post in there. I don't know if you can see that or not. And here we are. Check it out bulls i'm feeding them up on the top of the hill tops get the nu nutrition up there i don't know if you can see them or not but that's about eh, just just a little shorter than i am so i'd say it's about eh, five eight ish five nine i'm six foot one so i'm a little bit taller than that but the bulls and the cattle just absolutely love it they, uh, they use it to comb themselves out. There's not a tree in this pasture. There's only a quarter here. So it really is worth its weight in gold. I'll show you a bunch of pictures on that. And we got all the yearling calves, a couple bull calves in there, a couple steers. And let's take, well, I can see them from here, guys. There they are. Oh, they all survived. Look at that. Look at there. And they've grown. Holy cow, have they grown. They're huge. Look at that. Oh, a couple of them changed colors. Look at that. There's some black ones in there. Huh. See that big black one? I didn't put any black ones in there. That is totally cool. It turned spotted on me. They're pretty. Beautiful. It's been 40. We had some 45 below. We had a week where it stayed 40 below zero. Uh, sometimes ranging in 45 below zero. And look at them. Holy cow, did they turn out wonderful. Oh, my tank is all jacked up. Look at there. It's gonna rode out on me. It took some wire. Well, you guys seen the video, I guess. And that moss comes in there. There we go. Now it'll clean out. I gotta make something a little better. What I really should do is take some kind of pipe and bring it out so it cups up and the water can run into it. And then this wouldn't happen, probably. Now just by looking, I can tell you exactly every, who their daddies are, just by looking, and who their mommies are. And to you, they probably just like, look like pretty much black cattle. <laughs> Me, every one of them is special. You guys seeing this? Where are you guys? Oh no, they're hanging out under the water. Check that out. Look how pretty they are, you guys. All winter long, They've been just hanging out in there, keeping that tank clean. That used to be full of moss, just full of moss. I do keep a cinder block in there um, and a pipe, just in case predators would come, some kind of bird or something. They'd have a little bit somewhere to hide, I guess. A little bull calf I kept back out of my favorite cow. Doesn't look really impressive right now, but he will. Nothing this time of year looks real impressive. Oh, and the goldfish are doing great. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of them in there. They're doing great. Well, I guess we'll just jump into the show. If you like what you're gonna see, hit that thumbs up button, hit the like button, share us on your social media. Um, don't be afraid to leave comments. We truly do like them. I have picked the winners, by the way, for the contest, for the people. Awesome. That's coming up next show. Next show, I will show you who the winners are. And um, so be paying attention. Um, you are going to have to get me your addresses, uh, contact information, phone numbers, so I can get these sent out to you. Some of them are personalized, so they are going to have your name on them. Enjoy the rest what of the show. What you want to find is a brush for an old street sweeper. Now, street sweepers can be found in construction companies that specialize in roads, highway departments, and even cities. And you can usually purchase them for $75 to $100. Your cattle will thank you. Your bulls will thank you. Your horses will thank you. Your livestock will just love it. Even the dogs love it. And I'd be lying if I didn't tell you, I scratch my back on this thing all the time because it just feels great. They're durable. I took an 8-inch post, stuck it in the ground, 4 foot, put the brush over the top of it. Just works splendid. Absolutely awesome. <clears throat> Happy cattle are healthy cattle. The old traditional ways just aren't all that great. Now, <clears throat> this one is made by Happy Cow, and for like a dairy operation... This would be splendid. It's electric. You can Google these things. They're awesome. But for pastures with no trees or just a dry lot, I urge you to get something like this. Your livestock will thank you. Well, I hope you enjoyed this short video. And leave a comment in the comments. If you're doing something similar to this, please let us know in the comments. We can all learn together. Until next time, this is Luke Simons. Happy trails.